Hi friends, welcome to my YouTube channel SS Analysis. First of all, I'd like to tell you that if you're watching this video first time, subscribe my channel to see my more upcoming videos on the analysis of different commodities and equity indices. And second important thing is to watch this video till it's end to understand this solely to take your decision. You will like will motivate me to be regular in working more for you. So let us start the day to analyze the movements of S and Fernet futures in different time frames. So friends, here you can see a monthly chart of S and Fernet futures. So here you can see that how the S and Fernet futures finally form two exhaustive candles in the monthly time frame, which confirms an advent of a market crash during the upcoming months. So here you can see that how the formation of this first exhaustive candle during the month of November 2021 and the second exhaustive candle has been formed here during this month. So friends here I find that if the ascent fund futures find a big down below the 9 days moving average which is currently at the levels of 4372 during the month of January 2021 that will confirm an advent of a market crash where the ascent funded futures could see a steep fall from here during the month of January 2022 and this fall may continue where the next support can be seen at the 26 days moving average in the monthly time frame which is currently at the levels of 3471 but here I find that if the ascent for net futures are not able to defend this second support during the month of March 2022 where the next support can be seen at the lower end of each of the cloud which is currently at the levels of 2446 so friends here I find that if the ascent for net futures are not able to hold the low end of HMO cloud during the month of April 2022 will see this downward trend to continue where the final support can be seen at the 200 days moving average which is currently at the levels of 1977 so friends here I find that the 7400 futures could continue to remain under bearish pressure during the year 2022 if the 7400 futures find a big down well below the 200 days moving average during the month of April 2022 we'll see the 7400 futures to remain in a long term bearish pressure that may continue during the whole 2000. 2022. So friends here I find that the ascent funded futures could find some bounce back from this retracement zone which is from the levels of 1737 to 1556. So friends here I find that this level could provide strong support to ascent funded futures during this fall during the year 2022. So friends now let's check this move in a weekly time frame. So friends here you can see that in a weekly time frame here you can see that how the ascent funded futures have been constantly facing stiff resistance at the levels of 4743 and here you can see that how the formation of this red candle during this week confirms the continuity of this downward trend that may continue during this week. So here I find that if the s and funded futures start the upcoming week well below the 9 days moving average, we'll see the continuity of this selling pressure where the immediate support will be at the 26 days moving average which is currently at the 4462 in a weekly time frame. During the upcoming week we'll see this forward to continue where the next support can be seen at the upper end of which is a cloud which is currently at the levels of 4161 that will confirm the continuity of next market crash where the ascent finite futures could test the low end of HMO cloud which is currently at the levels of 3825 during the month of February 2022. So friends here I find that if the ascent finite futures are not able to hold above the low end of HMO cloud during the month of February 2022 we'll see the continuity of a short fall where here the major support can be seen at the 200 days moving average which is currently at the levels of 3295. So friends here I find that during the upcoming weeks the ascent funded futures could test the 200 days moving average. So friends here I find that if the ascent funded futures are not able to defend the major support at 200 days moving average during the month of March 2022 we'll see this fall to be more steeper where the ascent funded futures could test the levels of 2970. So friends here I find that the S&P 500 futures could retest the lows of 2020 at the levels of 2177. This level can be tested during the month of May 2022. 
because here I find that the Omicron could be the reason that could propel this bearish move in the S&P 500 futures. So friends, now let's check this move in a daily time frame. So friends, here you can see that how we have seen the continuity of two bearish candles in a daily time frame, where I find that if the S&P 500 futures find a big down during the upcoming week, well below the lower end of HMO crowd in a daily time frame, we'll see this downward trend to continue where a breakdown below the 200 days moving average which is currently at 4358 will confirm the continuity of a downward trend during the upcoming weeks where I find that the S&P 500 futures could find some bounce swing move from the levels of 4272 which is a significant support in a daily time frame so friends here I find that a breakdown below the levels of 4272 will confirm the advent of next market crash that may continue during the year 2022. So thank you friends, thanks for watching this video. If you like this video, don't forget to share this video with your more and more friends. Thank you.